We're here with head football coach at Fayetteville State University, head coach Lawrence Kershaw. Coach Kershaw, tonight was our first home game. Uh, tough, tough matchup against Virginia Union. It's a non-conference matchup, our third game of the season. Uh, we suffered a, a tough loss, 25-13. Coach, if you could, just talk a little bit about some of the miscues and uh, some of the things that you think just kind of prohibited us from being successful today. Um, it, it's, it, you know, it's tough. It's just frustrating, uh, to be honest with you, uh, because I, I feel, and again, I'm talking without looking at the film, uh, but I believe we left probably about five touchdowns uh, out there on the field, uh, which you just can't do. Okay, uh, we we got to make our plays. We talk to our guys a lot about making our plays, and when we have an opportunity to make them, uh, we, you know, we, we have to, and and we, we didn't. Um, again, again tonight. Um, again, I, I thought defensively we played phenomenally. Um, they've been playing great all season, um, but we keep falling up short in, in these close games. Uh, again, we talk to the guys all the time about you got to win all three phases. Uh, and right now, you know, we, we're doing well defensively. Uh, we're doing well special team wise, and offense offensively is where we're struggling. Uh, we're, we're, we're not holding our we're not holding our weight, um, and you got to be able to win all three phases in order to win a football game, and we just falling up short there. Um, and you know, we just we just not making our plays for for whatever reason. Uh, but again, it's my responsibility, uh, you know, to, to, to get it fixed, um, and we will. We you know we'll just continue continue working, we'll continue pushing, um, and continue moving, and and we, you know we'll, we'll be okay. Who are some of the student athletes you felt like did a good job in, in tonight's game, and, and some guys who, who you know could step up and do more? Well, you know, obviously everybody on defense did well, um, led, led by Michael Johnson, um, our All-American free safety. Uh, he, he's doing a phenomenal job. Uh, you know, I think everybody on defense is doing a good job. Randall Mash made a bunch of plays. Uh, John Brown did, did great in there. Timothy Thor, our linebackers, you know, they, they, they all did well. Uh, for the most part, offensively, I thought the uh, uh, the bright spot for us offensively was uh, was Christopher Hubert. Um, he's playing hurt. He's playing. He's playing on the ankle. Uh, he hadn't practiced all week, but you know he, he's a gamer, so he give everything he got. Um, and, and, you know he he's just trying. He's he's just trying to fight through. Uh, we got some guys that just got to play better. Um, our quarterbacks got to play better. Okay, um, they, you know Derek is kind of you know actually having a, a worse season than he had last year. Uh, which is a little disappointing. Okay, our offensive line got to play better. Okay, you know we, we got four seniors up there, uh, uh, people that been in the program uh, for the most part, and, and we're not getting it done there. Uh, and that receiver, which we knew we was going to struggle there because we you know we only had one returning starter, uh, so we knew there was going to be some struggles there, and, and we got we got to get that fixed. Um, and we will again. You know you just got to keep working. Okay, our, our center um, is kind of where we're struggling. That real talented kid. But he's a freshman, uh, so you know it's just it's just fighting through you know those, those kind of things, and unfortunately it's frustrating. But um, it, you know it's part of it, is what you got to go through. And again, we, we you know we we'll just keep fighting. Coach, win or lose, it's, it's one game at a time, and you got to move on to the next. And next week, we're going to your alma mater, uh, Virginia State. They got a, a strong program and uh, and some carryover from last year. What are some things that uh? You foresee for your program going into this matchup. It's the third road game in four games mm -hmm. that we can kind of break out of this slump and get on the right page. Well, you know, like, like I told the guys, and, and it's bleak because you're always you're disappointed that you lose, that you lost the game. So it's hard to, you know, look look forward and all those kind of things there. Uh, but like I told the guys, at the end of the day, all our goals are still in front of us. Okay, doesn't sound good coming from an 0-3 uh, football team, but we came from an 0-2 hole last year. Uh, we're pretty much the same guys. So we 0-3. The, the, technically, the preseason is over. Okay, now we're going to conference play. And the most important game is this one coming up. Um, if, if, if we can win out and do everything we're supposed to do, and again, it doesn't look that way, you know, talking from an 0-3 football team, but, you know, we feel we got a whole lot uh, to do with, with us being 0-3. Um, if you're getting blown out, then people are just better than you. You know, you, you can kind of uh, deal with that and accept that. But when, when, but when you're in games, you're losing close games, uh, that it's, it's frustrating because you know there was some stuff on your end uh, that you could that you could have did or done uh, 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 to to be victorious. Uh, but we get, again we got to keep pushing. Our goals in the, is in front of us, which is to win outside of the division, um, make it to the championship game, and ultimately win it. And I believe that that we still can. And again, it, it's my charge, it's my responsibility to lead this program to make our guys believe 
um, and stay confident uh, within themselves because we will as a staff uh, so, we, so we can make that happen. Coach, uh, sometimes guys can get in a, a funk when you don't start off the best way of, to a season. Mm -hmm. And um, you're a pretty upbeat guy. I know you're a strong leader of your program. How do you carry that? How can you get that attitude to carry on to your players and get them to understand what you were just talking about, that we're getting ready to go into conference play, so mm -hmm. the season really starts now. Right. Um, uh, uh, we can do a lot of talking, Okay, but I'm a, I'm a firm believer that action always speak louder than words, and, and they're gonna be looking for me. They're gonna be looking at me, and they're gonna be looking for me for leadership. Um, um, that's why I, you know, I, I don't ham I don't hammer on a guy, especially after a close loss. That's something that you, you just don't do. Uh, but you you just gotta make them believe. Um, and we got stuff to we got stuff to draw off of, uh, which is our experiences uh, from last year, and, and we we just gotta expand and, and you know, build upon that. Okay, uh, like, like I always promise the guys, I'm going to keep working. We're going to keep trying to prepare you as best we can. We need you to come to practice and work harder to get, to get better at what, what we can get better at uh, because it's a, lot of, it's a lot of correctable mistakes um, that's, that's out there. Um, and, and it's kind of we, we fix something, then something else happened. We fix this, then something else happened. You know, but that, that, that's kind of how it is. You know, we all frustrated. Like I told the guys, we all frustrated as a program, um, but we got to stay together, continue to believe in each other. Okay, I love them. Okay, uh, hopefully they, they, they love me. Okay, uh, you know we, we disappointed. The whole program is disappointed. Okay, um, we, you know we should be better than what we are. Our record shouldn't be what it is. Okay, but at the end of the day, it is what it is. Okay, now now what is it that you're going to do about it? And as long as we we, we as long as we're willing to keep fighting, okay, and keep giving the effort, uh, we'll we'll be okay. Coach, we truly appreciate the time. Uh, as mentioned earlier, definitely a tough loss. I'm sure you guys are kind of ready to get back on the field right now so you can bounce back. We'll definitely see you next week when we're in Petersburg taking on the Trojans of Virginia State. Wish you best of luck. Yep. Thank you. Thank I appreciate you. it.